Dresser and Press is officially updated for Halloween. And while there are some secrets like this interesting hot dog in this plant, I think this is the most iconic secret ever. But right outside of the VIP room in this planter, there is this hot dog suit that you can actually put on. Like, come on. This is probably the best Halloween costume, guys. Let me know if you're gonna become a hot dog this Halloween. I don't know. Maybe I will. But I asked you guys for some secrets on my community page, and a lot of you guys were talking about the hot dog costume, of course, but there's also some more. There's a pumpkin that you can hold if you go by the new items and click it. So what he's talking about is right over here, there is a pumpkin on this floor. You can actually click it, and now you can carry it. Uh, oh my gosh, it looks like I'm it's floating. I need to take this hot, hot dog costume off. There's also some toggles to this, so I can hold it. I can put it on my side, and I can also put it on my head, which is actually really cute. And this goes perfectly well with the new overalls. Like, come on. And a little secret to the overalls, there are also some toggles to that. But on number three, it looks like that you're like a painter. And if you guys didn't know, they added a painting thingy bobber. Not gonna lie, I totally forgot what this thing is called but let me know down in the comments below like an art palette so these two items go really well together and now i can be an artist like look how cute that is and the animation for this like please the vampire cape has toggles so they added a vampire cape it's actually in the vip section so if you go over here it's right here on this mannequin and this actually has some toggles so right now it's animated guys first of all this update is insane they have like animated items now which is insane but this one has a couple of toggles it has light air it has heavy air so like your cape is blowing real hard and then you can also turn off the cape and just have like the collar section so you can make like a really cool vampire look or whatever so love that cattail okay so this one is actually hard for me to find i don't know i'm blind it's not that hard to find because if you just go to the vip section there's a pumpkin that says kitty tail and if you click on the kitty tail you will get a little kitty tail so boom now i have a kitty tail and it moves like guys everything in this halloween update moves and it makes everything so much better also there's a server button up here now so you can click on it and then change your server which i think is fantastic also up here you can change the like light outside like the temperature not temperature what am i talking about no way i said temperature i meant like the time of the day but yeah you can change that in free play which is really cool also they now have dressing rooms so if you go inside this dressing room all your code items and currency items are here so if you bought things from robux if you bought things from cash there's also a couple of new cash items like the witch hat and all of that and the code items are there as well and you can now save items as well so if you click this check mark thing you can now make an outfit just type it ugly because i don't know what i'm wearing and then we can save it and then you can wear delete i'm gonna delete it but yeah that's how you can save outfits which is really cool and that's where all your code items are now so they're no longer on the side also there are a couple of new things on sale but what you have to do is go into the game pass section which now all the game passes are giftable which is amazing and this is where you can buy all of the stuff so you can buy the robux items and then there's also a couple of new things you can buy the skull thigh high boots the acoustic guitar supernova star set and then the witch set i already bought all of them on the stream but this is where you buy everything now instead of like finding them on the map and this is also where you can buy the pose packs there are like what five new pose packs and they are actually so awesome i love the halloween pose pack and also um guys look at this pose 28 but like it's even bendier and of course how can we forget about the new code item so the new code item is choopy is a back but remember these two are zeros this one is a one and the back the e is a four so you have to type it in correctly this is the correct code and i'll also pin it down in the comments below so you guys can just copy and paste it which will probably make it easier i already have it redeemed here but i'll show you guys the code item so if you go here again it's gonna be in the code items it's all the way in the bottom and it's this little set right here it's really cute i don't really know if i'm gonna use it that much to be honest but apparently it is uh inspired by k-pop so maybe it'll be useful for some of those but the details on this is insane like the heart pops up I love it. Also, right now, the Madoka set is no longer in the game right now. Apparently, it's getting reworked. The same as the, the Trendsetter dress. Yep, guys, the Trendsetter dress and the Madoka set are no longer in the game right now. Apparently, they're getting reworked or something. And this dress over here, it says it's being reworked. So this one's also gone. I'm not sure why they didn't do that for, like, the other dresses. They just removed them completely. But those items are sadly gone at the moment. There's a new animation when you pick up cash. There's a new screen when you rank up. Okay, so... So there's actually a lot of toggles in this so we're gonna check out all the toggles because i haven't figured them out either and to be honest they're a little secrets because i forget about toggles most of the time so we're gonna see what has toggles what doesn't have toggles and also there's a new animation at picking up money so let's go check that real quick 
Yeah. Oh, yeah, it's just like plus two and I like go. Oh, that's cute. I like that. Okay, let's head on over here and see all of the toggles. So let's put this on. Okay, this one doesn't have any toggles. Let's take that off. How about the werewolf ears? No toggles for that. I know this shirt has some toggles, so let's check that out. So this shirt has a one, two, three. This one's actually really pretty. It's like a cute little vest. I love it. And then you can also turn off the bottom part for the one and two. These pants also have a toggle to just turn off silk so you can make them less silky. We also have a top hat. The top hat doesn't have any toggles. This doesn't have any toggles either. The cat stuff doesn't have toggles. This one has a couple of toggles. So we have cat ears. We have cat ears with the nose covered. We have this, so no cat ears. And then the same thing with the nose and mouth covered, but no cat ears. This top doesn't have anything. Let's see about this one. This thing doesn't have anything either. How about this mic? Nope, nothing for the mic. How about the boots? These boots have nothing either. Oh my gosh, wait. Look at those heels on these boots. Oh my goodness, I could stab someone with that. Oh, these boots have... Oh my gosh, guys. <laughs> wait, there's so many toggles for these boots okay so this is number one we have two which i think just got higher yeah these are just higher oh even higher number three number four oh knee high boots and then i'm guessing these are just taller as well and then number seven oh my gosh guys do you see how high this is that's actually insane like bro if i tried wearing these irl i would literally fall off what the heck that that's crazy. Okay, that's actually insane. I was not expecting that. We also have some like bloody uh, necklace and earrings. Those don't have toggles though. We have the knife, which does have a toggle. There's a high one. Like it's gonna go in to stab someone, which is insane. We have the cute little candy cauldron, which also has a little toggle for the side and the front. We have a bell. No toggle for that. We have a cloak. Ooh, this one has a toggle. Okay, there's this one. And then there, wait, what's the difference? Oh, it's just skinnier. Okay, so I guess to like fit hair, maybe. We have uh, this set, which is actually really pretty. I don't think that, oh, there's a toggle for this. This set is so pretty. I love it. So we have the dress. So we can just use the corset as well. Then we can support uh, patterns and then we can turn off the lace on and off. We also have sleeves. Uh, these sleeves would be perfect for like a pirate fit. No toggles for that though. The overalls do have toggles like I showed you in the beginning. This hat has no toggles. And then we saw the pumpkin already. Okay, so those are all the toggles for that. But let's go into the VIP room and see if these things have toggles. So we already know about the cape has toggles. Let's see if this corset, ooh, this one has a little toggle for silk on and off. Maybe the same thing for this. Oh no, there's more. There's a square skirt. And oh, that's cute. We also have a pirate hat. No toggle for that. We have some earrings. No toggle for that. No toggle for this thing either. The sword has some toggles. So you can do this. You can do sideways. You can do downwards. And then you can also do a double wielded sword, which is... <laughs> the the coolest thing probably and of course we have the witch's broom which has a couple of toggles we have side sit sit front which is the cutest one we have walk and then we also have hold we have this dress which has just support patterns or not we have some gloves Ooh, this one has some patterns i mean uh textures textures toggles guys i can't talk so it just goes from long medium to short we have an eye patch here no toggles for that we have flowers no toggles for that either this dress has no toggles um what is that oh it's like a little wedding veil no toggles <gasps> the guitar has some toggles oh it just turns off owen's water mark okay so that's it for that oh these boots have some toggles it's probably oh <gasps> oh my gosh wait wait guys those are so wait those are so pretty oh my gosh i love that and then number three just makes them a little oh my gosh wait okay i don't really like the belts i'm not gonna lie but number two and number three might be my new favorite boots to use and then we have this thing which has no toggles the horns have no toggles either um let's see the skirt no toggles for the skirt but that's a really pretty skirt we also have this top no toggles for that and i think those are all of the halloween items now we do have some more halloween items in the currency stuff that we bought so let's head over to the dressing room and check those out so these are all the stuff that i bought we bought the acoustic guitar no toggles for that though there are a couple of toggles for this oh there's a lot so this is number one we have number two three four and five. Oh wait number five is cool you can just have like the wait that's actually so good for layering you can turn off the chains as well you can turn off texture okay that's a really good skirt for texturing i mean layering so highly recommend buying that by the way this is also the top for the supernova fit so that's one 
two, and three. Again, really good toggles for layering. And now we have the witch outfit. I don't think this one has any toggles, so that one does have toggles. Oh, this one has toggles. It's just patterns, though. Um, no toggles for that either, and then the witch hat has no toggles. So yeah, the witch stuff doesn't really have any toggles, but those are all of the currency items. We also have some Lana Lore quest items. So if you do the Lana Lore, you get these items, and they do have a couple of toggles. We have this shield, which you can put on the side and default. Also, by the way, if you guys want to know how to get all these items, I will be doing a Lana Lore quest video that will come out after a couple hours of this. So make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and turn that notification bell on so you don't miss that video. But I highly recommend doing the Lana Lore quest. It was so much fun. But we also got this bird cage. Like, that's actually, guys, the bird moves. But look at this one. Look at the hand. Like, you can hold it. You can put it on your shoulder. I'm actually going to zoom in because we're on free play because you guys have to see this bird. Look at it. It's like a working bird. Like, are you kidding me, guys? Dress to impress is insane. That's awesome. And then we also got this thing that only the it only works on mask. And then we have this dress that has a couple toggles as well. We have default, type 2, type 3, and type 4. I really like this dress. It's beautiful. So those are all the toggles for that. But also, they reworked these wings. Look, guys. It moves. It moves. And you can also turn it bigger. There's no three more wings, by the way. The three wings are gone, sadly. And the particles are on. Look at that. But those are um, those are the wings. They look realistic. But there's also some more toggle secrets, guys, with the new hair. So let's head on over to the hair and check it out. So this hair has a couple of toggles. You can do no bangs or only bangs. This hair has a couple of toggles, no bangs and only bangs as well. Harley Quinn's hair has no bangs and only bangs. I wonder if all of them have only bangs and no bangs. Okay, the ponytail has nothing. This one has bangs only or default. This one has bangs only as well. Oh, those are cute bangs. I like that. We have Jackie Laura's hair, which will also be no bangs and only bangs. We have this cute little bow hair. Again, no bangs, only bangs. I wonder if all of them are just no bangs, only bangs. Guys, I think they are all just all no bangs, only bangs. Like, we don't need to go through all of them. You know what I mean? But this one, guys. Actually, this one, this hair right here. Guys, you can add an extra strand, but you can animate it. I mean, come on. Look at that. My hair is animated. It's moving. Are you kidding me? You can also make it more animated. I am, I'm shocked. I am shook by all the animated stuff that Dress to Impress added. This is probably like my favorite thing ever. So that's a really cool hairstyle. We have this one that has no toggle. This one only has bangs, bangs, blah, blah, blah. Bangs, bangs, bangs. Too many bangs, guys. The dreads have a couple things. Oh, that's cute. This one also has no bangs, only bangs. This one has nothing. And then the last but not least, we have this one, which also has nothing. There's also some new masculine hair, I'm pretty sure. So let's go there. Ah, there is. There's some long hair. There's some braids. Oh, and this one has some toggles. So this one can be crazy hair, not crazy hair. And another secret, guys. Lana over here is a back, by the way, once you do the quest. And when you get your nails done... Oh my gosh, this girl is getting her nails done. Excuse me. I want to get my nails done, please. Oh, it's just not working. Oh, wait, I can't use Lana. That's the problem <gasps> wait guys my lana's broken what oh also another secret it actually tells you like what the theme is now so the theme is mall goth and if you click this button it says dark edgy style with a mall fashion twist so i actually really like how they have added that so now no one has to like go search things up and stuff like that but lana is broken i think right now but lana basically you can like pick different shapes of nails i don't know what's going on with her but oh well I wanted to show you guys that. But there we go, guys. I think those were all the secrets. Those were all the toggles for all the new items. Let me know if I missed anything. But of course, the best secret is this hot dog suit. Like, that's just hilarious. I love how they added that. But if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you leave a like, subscribe, and turn that notification on so you guys never miss a video. I will be posting another video today on all the Lana Lore quests. So if you need help with it or anything like that, check that out. It should be coming out in a couple hours after this. But if you have any other video ideas or anything that you guys want me to make on this update, let me know down in the comments below and maybe I'll do it. But I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!